important to get up to speed with these uh, with these changes. And then, yeah, you've got to try and implement them. It's one thing, it looks so cool when you see a driver that's changing the dials every corner, and you're like, wow, that is impressive. How's he doing that and keeping on the absolute limit? And it is impressive, and it is technically the fastest way to get around the lap. But if you, you you've got to take up some element of mental capacity to do that. And if you don't change the setting back at the right time, you're going to be in for a really nasty surprise when you get to the next corner and you've suddenly got a really forward brake balance or you've got way too much oversteer or something. And um, yeah, it, it, there's basically, you can, you can lose out on driving by trying to be too clever. So there's a balance to be had, but definitely that's the area where the, the experienced drivers have a bit of an early advantage. Great to get Jolene Palmer's insight. He will be with us for all three days later on, returning to the com box. We'll have Karun, we'll have Martin, and we'll have Crofty as well. We're hoping to be joined by Sam Collins and Will Buxton before our shift ends. Uh, we're just tracking Max Verstappen right now. He's pushing right now. Um, and he was not too far away from the car. You can see no improvements uh, from sector one or sector two. And he comes around the 15th and final corner, trying not to get too much on the kerbs. And uh, 